Milwaukee LGBTQ Community Center had to stop in person activities and outreach for more than a year due to the pandemic. That affected a lot of people, but today it has a new home and new hope. Sarah McGrew shows us. Right now it's empty walls and construction dust, but soon this building will be bursting with pride. You're always going to be greeted with a warm smile and you know you're wanted here. This is where the Milwaukee LGBT Community Center started 23 years ago on 315 West Court Street, but just in a tiny corner of the building. The center then moved to a location downtown, but now it's time for even more growth and getting back to its roots. It's a full circle. This time though, um, we will be occupying 90% um, of the building. Over the last two decades, the center has provided critical services for folks in the LGBT community in Milwaukee. When it was created, um, it was because there was a need to feel safe, to feel that you could be who you are um, without fearing um, <laughs> violence or attacks. That need to feel safe is still prevalent today. In 2019, there were nearly 9,000 hate crimes committed in the U.S. About 19% of those were based on sexual orientation or gender identity. We want to be that space. We want to continue um, to meet the needs of the community. But it's been over a year since the community has had a physical space to gather. And so when the doors finally open, it will be that much more of a reason to celebrate. So with the LGBTQ community, one of the things that um, unfortunately um, are at higher risk is that uh, isolation, right? Social isolation. So um, that's one of the reasons actually that we exist. We exist because we are that space that is safe where you can be your beautifully authentic self. Some of the services the center offers include counseling, adult and youth programming, alcohol and other drug programs and services, and a name change clinic. The new center won't officially open until later this summer, but tonight from six to eight, staff is holding a block party in the parking lot. You can stop by, hang out, and learn more about the services provided. Reporting in Milwaukee, Sarah McGrew, TMJ4 News.